city has increased tremendously, creating substantial economic growth for Greek business throughout the past. Everyone! B -b 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 what gas? What are you talking about? G -g -g Greeks and Egyptians have lost harmony with each other. The g -g gods are displeased because of it. I'm Nanefer, and I don't know if I'm g -g 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 Greek or Egyptian. I'm an orphan. Lost harmony? What do you mean? The Egyptian g -g goddess Wajed is sending snakes into g -g Greek quarters at night. Only g -g Greeks have been killed. We are out of b -b -b balance. See for yourself. Just n n north of the villa. Okay. I will look into this gas. That was harder than it should have been. <clears throat> Neck! What is that? The gods are rumbling. It came from just north of here. Must have something to do with this curse. What happened? This jar does not belong here. I think there is movement inside. A snake! The jars have been used to transport them. Ah, I can smell the burnt flesh. This man was pinned down and died in the blaze. The structure is badly damaged. I cannot go any further. The trail leads outwards. I should look around the courtyard. Another foreigner cursed by Wajet. That is three this week. Those useless Greeks had it coming, if you ask me. But what do I know? I am just the lowly Egyptian caretaker who cleans up after the naked Yadit. Hey, be careful what you say. People have died. I need to look around. What you need to look at is the color of your skin, son. Harmony is what we need. Not more senseless judgment. Look, some of us have built a shrine in a cave under what is left of the great temple. Why don't you come and honor Wajet with us? Egyptians have to stick together. Maybe I will, after I look around. These jars are the same as the ones I saw in the Greek area. They are breeding the snakes here. Ah, snakes again! Why did it have to be snakes? An elaborate shrine to the serpent goddess Wadjet. They are breeding the snakes here. Gods, I hate snakes. Sound of it. I do not have to find the caretaker after all. He has already found me. He cannot escape! Caretaker! The snakes were yours! You son Greeks! Come on then, you worthless Ionian slave! Do your master's bidding like a good man! I fight for you! This is what Ptolemy has done to Egypt. A land... What is going to happen to that stupid, stuttering creek inside? Can you stand? Thank Serapis you're here. 
I d d d d don't think so. They b b b beat me. Be still. I will carry you out. Can you walk? They beat me. They beat me because they thought I'm Greek. Wait. What happened to your stutter? I was scared when I first met you. It makes me stutter. By the gods, is nothing true. Well, you are alive, Nanifa. Be thankful. I'm alive, but Egypt is out of balance. You must know, Magi, the law is harmony between all peoples. May Serapis unite us all. That is the end of the caretaker's cult. But Nanifa is right. Egypt is out of balance. And that is the order of ancients doing. Who is this shrine dedicated to? I am praying for the people killed by fires in Dionysius. Someone is burning down their farms. You, Magi, could help to stop it. I will try to help. Entire villages of people have disappeared in Vicenharis. There are rumors at the caravanserai that demons have invaded. Demon? What are you doing? A mysterious plague has struck the poor in Uhemeria. Their bodies are being burned, cursing their souls for eternity. They will never reach the field of reeds. I am trying to find a cure for them. There is always a cure. I just need the right combination. Burning the dead? What madness is this? Entire villages of people have disappeared in Vicenharis. There are rumors at the caravanserai that demons have invaded. Demons? I have never seen one. I should check this out. Burning corpses? This... Hey! Why are you burning the dead? Don't you fear the gods? Their souls will be forever cursed. I'm sorry to do it, but I have no choice in this. The gods themselves have afflicted us with a pestilence. The dead must be burned to save the living. What pestilence? Is there a plague? Truly, I don't know. Elders have begun falling sick. Children have died clutching their bellies in agony as their parents watch on, lifeless in their beds. This would be cruel, even for the angriest of gods. No one cares about us. Any help would be appreciated. In the Fayum, the poor aren't worth spit. Corpses. This is blasphemy. Who did this? My children, your hunger is known. Turn to Sobek for your nourishment. There are no signs of a plague on the body. Now lose their land. They used to eat at the arms kitchen in the market, but soldiers began harassing them. Greek merchants said they were bad for business. Are filthy. It's what have the villagers been eating? They must have the food stored somewhere. I should have a look around. We should move this way. <laughs> These arms contain strong seasonings. This food is rancid. It smells like shit. It is completely unfit for eating. This gruel is not fit for rats, let alone people. The strong spices are not for taste. They are disguising the rot. I need to talk with whoever made it. Sobek has provided a way. Though the food is humble, it gives life. Eat with thanksgiving. Tell me about the food you eat. Where does it come from? A merchant makes it for the poor here. It's not much, but at least it's something. We're thankful. You're welcome to try some. By the gods, no. I do not know how you stomach it. I need to talk to the merchant. Where can I find him? His house is to the south of the town market. 
I can take you. Let's visit this merchant of yours. I will follow you. May Sobek reward you for helping. I've passed many prosperous farms. People here seem to be doing well. Why are there so many poor? Ah, yes. Those are Greek farms. The Greeks pay lower taxes, so they prosper. Meanwhile, the Egyptian farmers are slowly forced from their lands. What happens to the land when the farmers leave? Once the owners die, by law the land is freed. If it's good land, the Greeks take it. If not, the desert takes it. Either way, Egyptians are left to starve. Many end up in the slums. This is the home of the merchant who provides the food. Even the cats here look better fed than the poor. The owner is obviously of substance. Not all Egyptians seem to be equal. Some are just more equal than others. This is awful! No wonder people are falling sick. Who would do this? It is time we met this poisonous merchant. Give him a taste of his own cooking. How may I help you? This is my home. Are you lost? You can explain to me why you have been poisoning the poor. My guess is so you can take their land. It is easier if they are dead. You're referring to the trouble in the slums? Whatever you've heard, I assure you, you misunderstand. I do what I can to help. I have seen your kitchen merchant. I know what you are doing. And I will see that you are brought to justice. Oh, I see. Well, that changes things. Now, you're trespassing. And I have the right to protect myself. Men! If you were reasonable, I wouldn't have to do this. We could have worked this out. I'm not saying over. This merchant of death was murdering the poor for their land. His love of money was their real sickness. Fayum won't miss him. The dead can rest. There will be no more burning. Otifres, what is going on? My friend, you came. <laughs> I am glad. Who is this? Where is Renut? My wife is wherever she goes, withdrawn and cold. This is uh, yesterday. She was just leaving. You are a pig. I was bored anyway. Thanks for the wine. Renut is probably down at the lake. I will take you to her. Let me know when you are ready to go. Otifles, what is this? What are you doing? You will lose everything. I know, I know. I am useless to anyone right now. Then stop being useless. Be angry. Pick up your sword and start fighting. I hung up my sword years ago. I only got involved because Apollodorus practically demanded it. He thought us all threatened by some grave conspiracy. Now Shadi is dead. Something big is happening. You are right to try to help. I was stupid. I did not want to do it. Cannot insist it, said it was our duty. If I had not listened to her, Shadi, I would still live. She will be up ahead. 
We built a shrine by the water. Shadia loves the water. We feed the fish before supper. I mean, she did. We used. Medes Basob! Renut, it is good to see you. Renut? This is how she is now. <laughs> There is something that might help. In Siwa, we have a ritual to mark a loved one's passing. Would you mind? Go ahead. The ritual requires something. I will return shortly. I have what I need. You'll do what you're told, you lazy shit. If you need more grain, grow more. It's not my problem. Captain! Henut, no! We can't! I know you are not extorting grain from this farmer. Because you know that would be violating several Egyptian laws. As officials of Fayum, we both know it. Don't we? I will see you soon. Official. My husband. We must shake off our grief. We cannot let others suffer too. Not when we can stop it. You were a fighter once. It is time to fight again. You see yourself the corruption. There is no one to protect you. Why did we not just kill that Egyptian cow? Oh, don't worry. The commander has got something special done for her. See how proud she is when we remove her tongue. We'll come back tonight and got her quietly. What do you think, huh? <laughs> Hold! Move! Hey, what? No space! Maintain protected formation! Hey, hold! Insignia. I do not recognize this. Maybe Hotepres knows more. He will not be missed. But he spoke of a commander. Someone else is giving the orders. This is not over. You live! They'd marked Renut for death. Death found them fast. I envy them. Well, it had to be done. These soldiers do not seem to understand anything else. There's more. The captain was under orders. I found this insignia on him. Do you know it? Yes. This is not good. It is from Fort Bubastos to the east. Run by another Malakia who thinks himself untouchable. Henut was right. People will continue to suffer unless we act. Bayek, I am sorry to ask this. We need your help. You have it. There's something I must do fast, though. I will return soon. Shadia, my lotus. No other will suffer as you did. I swear it. Bye, my little tadpole. Swim forever free.
It is true. The soldiers were only the beginning. We have to deal with this commander. We need more information. How far does the corruption go? It may rise as far as Ptolemy's inner circle. We cannot trust any Falakitai. We cannot do it alone. We need Fayum. Most of the farmers will not talk for fear of the soldiers. But they are angry. It will not take much to convince them. Let me talk to that farmer the captain was threatening. I will spread the word. Seni, I saw what happened with the soldiers. Nebet Khenu took a big risk. I appreciate what she did, but it won't change anything. I'm sorry, but I must keep working. I've got a stack of fires to light. Let me help then. Lighting your fires. You don't give up, do you? Ra will ensure your crops are fertile, Sid. A bit simple, are you? There you are. It is time to rise up against the soldiers. Potifres will fight with you. Potifres? He abandoned us long ago. His father was a good man. He gave his son an Egyptian name. We loved him for that. But he could not give him an Egyptian heart. Hotefres means satisfied in our tongue. But he never was. He soon left us to the hyenas and crocodiles. Yet crocodiles may still be defeated. The captain is no more. Rise, Seni. Spread the word. You defeated the captain? Wow. You are a madman. Okay. If you are willing to do this, I will join you. I will spread the word, Seni. I did not know things were this bad. I mean, I knew there was trouble, just not like this. This is my fault. I did not want the responsibility here in Fayum. The inheritance was forced on me. I wanted to stay on my ship, the adventure. Now, I realize. Giving up is a choice, and I am still alive. They must be in the villa. Take the pack. You, come with me. Soldiers! Where are you, Malakia? Come down! We need a talk! Looks like the choice has been made for him. Come, brother. Let us talk to them. With our swords. I have got your back. And it is good to have you back, brother. well for someone retired. <laughs> I am not old yet, Siwan. I can see that. But it will not be enough. The soldiers will come in greater numbers now. I inherited more than a strong sword arm. I will hire a private army if I need to. I might have a better idea. Bayek, could you accompany me on a short journey? I'm ready. Let's go. You two make a good team. Hotefres has lost none of his fire. You sound proud of him. <laughs> it is nice to have back the man I married. Where are we going? 
There is a rebel camp nearby. It is to the east of here, by Fort Bubastos. We are going to meet with them. Rebels? Who's dealing with them, not Andy Raff of Alexandria? Alexandria is no stranger to intrigue, Magi. Favors are sometimes traded for information or protection. Such alliances are necessary if not officially acknowledged. This way. Their camp is just up ahead. We should be cautious. Rebels are not known for their hospitality. I sent word. They are expecting us. I am Henut. I sent word from Philadelphia that we were coming. We need your help. You wasted your time. Sorry, we cannot help you. We are not asking for charity. We can offer food, supplies, and information. All we require in return is protection for our people. I said we cannot help. Soldiers captured our leader down at the dam. Then perhaps we can help you. This is Bayek of Siwa. You are Bayek of Siwa? We were told what you did at the arena. Beating the Gallic brothers like a madman. And I suppose today, I play the madman again. Thank you. Who are you to attack soldiers so openly? Don't you fear waking Greece? I am Bayek of Siwa, and I am more afraid of Egypt sleeping. Crazy Siwan! My men spoke of you, fighting in the arena single-handed like a madman. Nick! They told me dogs have no chance if you're on our side. And I will need you on my side when it matters. <laughs> The way back from here is clear. Before you go, I need a favor. Henut is waiting at your camp. She will ask for your help to protect our people. I owe you my life. You have my word, it will be done. Would you also tell her I go to Fort Bubastos? I have business with the commander there. Alone against a fortified garrison? Are you crazy? Perhaps. I am Bayek of Siwa. Horns. Voices. Someone else is attacking the fort. It seems all of Fayum has turned against the commander. That is the end of his corruption. I should meet the others. It is done. You had help. The farmers staged a protest to distract the soldiers. They were fearless. The rebels also did their part. You've inspired them, Bayek. In truth, they are in awe of you. Our farms will be well protected. They love their crazy sea one. They won't let another crocodile plague the Fayum again. Your people are free now. It is a good start. Otifres, it is time to live up to your name. And my duty as a husband. Shadia liked you immediately, you know. You always have a home here. 
if you need it. Have my goods brought you many victories? Reda! <laughs> Good to see you. Yes, of course they have. Thank you. You know, at times I feel we are family. Ah, you would not want that, Magi. My dear mother poisoned my father in a fit of passion. Then she died in the Nile. From a hippo attack. I was left with nothing but this camel. A sad tale. Reda, when we last spoke, their fate involved a bronze bull. Oh, really? Your memory must be off. Too many hours in the sun baking your mind. The past is what our dreams make of it. <laughs> well... <laughs> you mad ruffian. I love your stories no matter their truth. It is good to see you again, Reda. Yes, yes. What can I offer you today? You gonna buy something or not? You should have killed me! Now you die! <laughs> you are by Akasiwa, aren't you? I've heard stories of the Medjai who crossed the desert. I am Theodorus, one of many who rebel against the Falakitai. Is that what landed you in this cage? Yes, a failed attack. I am hunting Daratos, a ruthless general of Ptolemy, with a hatred for Egyptians. A killer of mothers, and fathers, and children. I won't rest until his body is food for the worms. Would you lend your sword? Gladly. Your plight is true. Good joy. We will regroup with my men in Bacchus. Come along. How does a Greek find himself fighting an Egyptian cause? My father was Egyptian. My mother, Greek. Long ago, a day came when I discharged every ounce of Greek blood from my body and pledged to rid Egypt of men like Deratos. And we nearly did. We found his camp, we made a great announcement, and we were forced to disband. Whoa. Now that that is taken care of, I was captured by a scouting convoy and beaten into giving up our retreat point. But you instead led them into a trap. Clever. I knew my brothers would rescue me, but I did not know the Medjai from Siwa would be among them too. You are rather celebrated amongst my group. We spent years tracking you, only to learn you made waste of him single-handedly. You would not. We will take shelter here and wait for the right moment to strike. <laughs> Call us your ally, but our goals seem to be aligned from time to time, don't they? You are not incorrect. I will get briefed. Dogs, they've sent out scouting groups. Theodoros, Theratos has left. Theratos is gone. Neck, he continues to elude me. What should we do? Let's be smart. We have an opportunity to claim two victories with one swift strike. We need to wait for Doratos to return to camp. I've learned his personal scribe has stayed behind in Karanis. We'll be targeted if we so much as take a piece nearby. You are unknown to them. Bring the scribe to us. He'll tell us what we need to know. How do I find him? 
At night, he rests within the courtyard. During the day, you can find him working around the temple, or at the terrace overlooking the lake. He dresses elegantly, and due to our failed attack, now has guards in tow. He'll be hard to miss. Must you follow me around everywhere? Strict orders from the General. We are not to leave your side. He's overreacting. I am safe here. The Ratos won't take any chances. The Rebels could strike again. We are all on high alert. Him. It won't be long before he comes to. I need to bring him back to Theodorus. That is him. Well done. We will find out what he knows. In the meantime, we must prepare our attack. Some of our brothers are stationed just west of Soknopayo. Meet with them, and wait for my arrival. We will put an end to that Nekotiodet. A scribe who knows his way around Garanis. Veratos, where is he? That name means... <laughs> Must have had the Greek wine. Are you Theodorus' men? Yes. And who are you? He is the Siwan. I come on his behalf. He'll be joining us shortly with instructions. Good. The soldiers are reeling, but it won't be long before reinforcements arrive. Come. Theodoros! Ready your blades and check your arrows. The Rathos will be back at the camp before sunrise. You're with me, but don't forget, he is mine. What is your stake in this? This is more about him than it is about your war. My father grew figs in the Fayum. The best. Theratos taxed him. An Egyptian has no choice but to pay. One season, the harvest was so poor that my father struggled to give his cut. Theratos figured him for a cheat. He took a bite of fruit to prove his point. He got a mouthful of worms. His men laughed. But Theratos was furious. I watched as my father was hanged from his own tree and picked at by every animal in the region. Taratos embodies the unjust. He is why I am who I am. I need you, Bayek. Tririm! The gods have brought us together for this! Justice will be served today! <laughs> For Egypt! For your father, Theodorus! Veratos dies today! <laughs> Leave no one alive! Clear the camp! Move, worms, take Move. you! This area is off limits. I will crack your puny skull! has fallen. Finally, my father's car is at peace. Let's move! 
We have a long trek ahead. And so it was proven that... And so, the scouts were right. Your Bayek, the Midjai from Siwa, son of the Nile and defender of the people. I am Nawa, and the rebel cause needs your strength. My oath is to protect. Tell me more. Sebni, my cousin, told the children stories of Alexander the Great. Of course, two of the children decided that meant there was treasure of his to discover nearby. As children will do. Indeed. Sebni and one of our warriors went to search for the children, but the Pharaoh soldiers captured them. Do you know where they are? Yes. One of our scouts saw them. They're being held prisoner in Camp Hetu Imazo, north of here. Please find them. Sebni is the only one who knows where those children have run off to. I will find him, and then the children. Pathologies. Trying to stop our equalities. Where is the coward that did? There is no way all this blood is from one cat. I still do not know what happened here. I should investigate further. A Roman soldier. Dead. Only one wound. He bled out quick. Bloody footprints. Leading to the north. Neck. The cat was attacked by the Roman soldier. Whoever did this was protecting them. The trail goes to the north. I must follow it. These Egyptians are already looking to fight. I must find whoever did this. Cats are gods! Huh? <laughs> See, your cat is injured. It is not mine. Cats belong only to Bastet. I am only her instrument. Defending her from Roman scum. You took the life of a Roman because he killed cats. And now you risk a riot in Alexandria. Bastet swung her fury through my arm. I am her servant. I know a high priestess who would love your... dedication. It would be best for you to serve Bastet at her temple in Bubastis. I have served Bastet my entire life. To serve her better would be an honor. Lead on, brother. We should keep our voices down. We don't need any untoward attention. I know the way. Let us fly. It will get me closer to the goddess faster. Oi! <laughs> Roman soldiers, terrified of our tiny little kittens. Is there no end to your speech? Oh, the Amelias, who are in love with me? Dinamax and the Where were we? Go to the temple of Bastet. Only, I beg you not to mention my name to the priestess. I could, Medjai. But think of how a return to Alexandria might be served by the great warrior Khalid. I believe this is what the gods want you for. If the gods will it, it will be done. Safe travels, Medjai. May Bastet watch over you.
And what are you looking out for? Take care of your ego. Roman hunters capture every beast they find. Tahira? What are you... It's nice to see you too, Bayek. You look better. You knew I was in the region. I hoped. You live awake when you pass. Even I have had stories of Bayek of Siwa. Why are you so far out here? I'm defending this valley from becoming a Roman slaughterhouse. They capture our beasts, and they slaughter them in Rome before they are gods. Hmm. I've heard the stories. I cannot stand against them alone. I prayed to Sobek, and he delivered... you. Huh? Come! Tahira! Wait! Hey! How did your path ever bring you this far? After we parted ways, I found myself caught by strong currents. Did you ever return to Siwa? To your role as Medjai? Briefly. It was no longer home. And you? How did you end up here? I took inspiration from you. Consider me a protector. What is this place? Shrine to Sobek. Very old. Very dangerous. Climb. It is not safe down here. But that doesn't mean it isn't without power. Shh. Watch. Fire Moon's horns. <laughs> Sobek's child. Where is she? There's one missing. The Romans. Find me near the Roman camp. By a moon, she's fast. Roman's hunger is insatiable. Sobek's daughter is inside. Tonate. Uh, best not to draw attention here. By a moon. That is a crocodile. Awesome, isn't she? What are you waiting for? Smash the cage! Thank you. With Sobek's favor, the Nile will flood again this year. You're welcome. Never thought I would think of crocodiles as romantic. Fearsome, but beautiful in their ferocity. See me at my home before you leave here, yes? All right. I will. Here, Bayek! The gods still have need for us!
What are your plans now, Tahira? Sobek is not done with me yet, and thus, he still has use for you. Are you game? I have much to do. What more do you need? The Roman hunters still infest this area like maggots. In time, they will come together and undo our work. They will consume everything. But if we strike now while they are alone and separated, we may bloody them enough to drive them off. Do you truly need my help? I would not ask otherwise. Work. Though I do not know what they do with the flamingos. They eat the tongue. A Roman delicacy, boiled with dates. Or so I've heard. Sounds terrible. How long have you been out this way? Long enough for scar tissue to grow over some wounds. But some are still raw. Wait! That is not a right sound. Speak the bushes for the great sacred crocodiles. Glory and reward for whomever finds and catches them. Those pus-filled scabs. They are defiling the shrine and trying to recapture Sobek's children. Good. Sobek's children can grow fat off Roman bones. <laughs> I think you might be Sobek's adopted daughter. <laughs> oh, hush. Come. There are more of these Roman maggots to find. When we parted, you still had more names to find. I found them. And did they ease your night terrors? No. Rather, they unlocked a whole new world of atrocities. That was God's work, Bayek. It was good to be at your side again. My father always said to be wary of a smiling crocodile. But I will take Sobek's favor if he is offering. I do not know how long he will continue to smile. Cities like Heracleon are a blight upon the land, driving the gods away from here. We are witnessing the end of an age. I thought I was supposed to be the somber one. <laughs> you are right, my brother. It was good to see you, Tahira. May all the gods watch over you. And you. I will follow Sobek's children into the green. I hope you find what you are looking for. Plans. They are harnessing elephants to fight? And they are honing their killing instincts on the farmers? By the horns of our moon! The size of this beast! The power behind it must be immense. It must have taken a full cow just to make this harness. This is no farm, but a major military encampment. Any decency in your heart, you will free us. You wear the guards. These were no soldiers. Simple farmers. Bones ground up. Heads like smashed cabbages. Those ragged voices. Those must be the last of the farmers that they have imprisoned. Thomas! <laughs> Huh. 
too kind. Thank you so much. May Iset and Horus and Serapis and Anubis and... Hurry, fool! Thank them later! Does anyone know Yusinem? What? That's me! Thank you, friend. While scouting the Roman forces, I foolishly fell into their hands. It's barbaric. They train elephants to battle with bloodlust and force them to kill hapless prisoners to harden them. Can you make it back from here? Of course. I will find Apollodorus and tell him.